Hi guys, well look at this. It is an absolutely spectacularly over the top, gorgeous, what are we? Wednesday morning, March 20th, 2013, and spring has sprung in the, <coughs> well, I don't know if it's the drought plagued wasteland of South Austin, Texas or not. We had two thunderstorms last night. Two thunderstorms to bid goodbye to winter time, if you could call what we just had winter time. And spring has sprung and I just wanted to take a little video tour around my trailer on the first spring morning. Now, so here we are right outside my trailer where unfortunately the uh, I guess these thunderstorms kind of beat up my my little flower garden right outside but they'll it'll recover in a day or two so this is mostly I planted way too much cilantro in this mix this is my cilantro larkspur poppies does anybody know what this thing is it's absolutely gorgeous this flower here look at those little poppies look at those little poppies and uh so we got all this going on it looks like i got some bachelor buttons they're gonna be busting out here the next day or two uh look at the uh look at the virginia creeper beginning its creep before the caterpillars find it and eat it. I love Virginia creeper. People think this is poison ivy, of course. It's a mimicking species. Now my iris bed, they're not gonna bloom this year. I just planted them last fall. All right, what's going on and what's left of my garden here on the first day of spring? So I've got a few, a few uh, mustard greens have made it through and survived. The onions are looking gorgeous. I don't have my glasses on. I can't see what's in the, what's in the thing. Look at this, my little baby zinnias popping out of the ground. This will soon be a line of zinnias here. We got the peach tree in bloom. And here's my, look at these taters. Someday I will tell you the story of the organic potato king of South Austin, Texas. Look at all these taters, guys. This is all different kinds of uh, red, yellow, blue. I don't know what all I planted here. This whole bed will be potatoes. Good looking, uh, look at that. Good looking collard greens. Good looking collard greens. You know, guys, wouldn't it be nice if the weather would just stay like this? Of course, it was in the 90s the day before yesterday. It was up in the 90s on March 18th, and then it'll be back in the 90s the day after tomorrow. But today, it's just just spectacular. Look at that, Bobby. And also, if anybody knows what these things are, they look like some little miniature, some little miniature snapdragon. They come in a bunch of different colors. I got purple, yellow, white. There's my first ladybug of the year. I'm sure you can't see it. It says this flower. that thing and uh, here's this it's almost bloomed out now this is this yeah this is one plant one plant I have no clue what this thing is I didn't even realize I was planting it and look at this uh, good lord look at that thing one little mystery plant if anybody knows uh, even the weeds even the weeds are beautiful. 
you can't see all the honeybees on them. Anyway, enough of celebrating springtime. I gotta get back on my rock on this gorgeous day to talk about what is it? Oh yes, today is Wednesday, so I get to talk about global warming and climate change, which was, as I say, was here two days ago, and we'll be back in two days. But uh, for today, we are celebrating the springing of spring. Bye guys.